Um, hi, I'm Sarah Mikesel. We're at the National Cattlemen's Beef Association Conference in Tampa, Florida, and we're talking today with Dmitry Popov with Zoetis. Can you talk to us a little bit about what uh, what customers are asking you about from a BRD standpoint? Absolutely. So, uh, bovine respiratory disease is uh, one of the primary uh, problems within the industry. We have uh, experts estimate it's a $1 billion uh, cost in the economy of the world. And so, uh, Zoetis uh, has three very strong and effective solutions to offer our customers. Uh, the three products are Draxin. Exceed and Atmosphere, all three injectable anti infective products. And tell me a little bit about the benefits of each. They, they're obviously not all for everybody. Absolutely. Typically, cattlemen, especially in the stopper and the feedlot segment okay. where most of uh, you know, cattle pneumonia would occur, um, tend to use a, a combination in terms of a variety of different programs for this. They don't just stick with one product. So typically, they want to do a rotation of active ingredients to avoid potential resistance and to complement uh, the products. So there will be probably one product used for control of bovine respiratory disease or on arrival, and Draxin is a great fit for that specific end use. Uh, there will be a product used for retreating cattle that are still sick after that, mm -hmm. and Exceed is an excellent product to complement Jackson in that regard. Now, Addison would come as the sometimes the third product in this chain, where uh, if you're in a finishing yard or a feedlot and you're getting closer to that shipping period, right. and uh, there's some uh, sensitivity around potential residue testing, Addison has the lowest withdrawal period in the industry, and it's four days withdrawal, so Addison would be great uh, to treat late in the, in the period for uh, this Sounds good. And BRD, is this, is this something that every producer deals with? Oh, absolutely. I think, um, especially in the in the stalker and, and feedlots, it's uh, it could be very devastating. Um, there is seasonality to this. You will have more uh, BRD in the fall um, than you will have in the spring, and because of the cattle are really good for cold temperatures, but what they can't take is the fluctuation in temperature. So when you have these cold days where you have, you know, uh, cold mornings and then it goes up and then it goes cold again in the evenings, you will you'll have cattle get sick. What about from a cow-calf standpoint? Is, that, is BRD still an issue with cow-calf operations? BRD is still an issue with cow-calf operations. Now, it, it is not as predominant as in other segments. And so you will have uh, some use, but primarily vaccines would be used there. Okay. And once in a while, you would get get our calf being sick and, and needing an antibiotic. Sounds good. Well, thanks so much for all your time today. It's been great hearing about BRD and the solutions that Zoetis has to offer. Absolutely. I'm Sarah Mikesell, reporting for thecattlesite.com.